A new judge will have to take over the case of the man accused of murdering two little boys, boys while, while behind the wheel of a car. This continuing delay has the mothers of the victims saying that the attorneys defending Ken Cody Barlow have been allowed to get away with way too much. Jake Taylor was at that hearing today in Provo. It's now been two and a half years since little Odin Ratliff and Hunter Jackson were killed. Today's hearing making it seem clear that it may be most of another year before the families of those two could see any resolution. Today, it's been 875 days since the boy's death. 875 days of waiting for justice. In Monday's hearing, Judge Robert Lund gave a thorough recounting of everything he says has delayed this trial again and again and again. That was a more than a reasonable amount of time for the court to expect that the parties be ready to try the case. Culminating with the state Supreme Court allowing the lead defense attorney to leave the case following his father's death, despite Judge Lund's objections. The judge himself at times visibly frustrated with these delays. This is ridiculous. The mothers of the two three-year-old boys killed spoke out about how these delays have hurt them and all those who loved Odin and Hunter. How many times will we be told that we have to wait? Put our lives on pause, our jobs on pause, our grieving on pause. Where is the accountability in the two years that this has been drug on? Angry at what they say the court has allowed the defense team to do. Welcome to Benjamin Aldana and Marissa Flower Day's nightmare experience. Because that's what this case has become. And still no clear date set for trial. As along with a new defense attorney having to prepare, Judge Robert Lund says another judge will have to take over the case as he retires at the end of this year, and he says there's no way the case could be done by then. Unfortunately, uh, exactly what I was hoping to avoid happen. But here we are, trapped in a state of unknowing. Unknowing if this heartbreak will ever end. Statements from the new defense attorney in this case say due to other trials he has coming forward, it won't be until at least March or April of next year that he'll be prepared for a trial in this case. Jake Taylor, KUTV, 2 News. This is a story we've been covering for more than two years now. If you'd like to go back and read any of our in-depth reporting on this case, just click on the Investigates tab. You can find that on our website or the 2 News mobile app.